Good day everyone! I'm your teacher Joji and I'll discuss to you the algebraic expression. The first thing to do, we will define the basic terms used in algebraic expression. Algebraic expression is a constant, a variable, or a combination of variables and constant involving a finite number of fundamental operations in algebra. Here are the basic terms used in algebraic expressions. Number one, a constant. A constant is a symbol that assumes one specific value. For example, 5, 79, 5. So, ibig sabihin, kaya siya tinawag na constant, hindi hindi na mababago ang kanyang value. Nakafix na siya. Number 2, a variable. A variable is a symbol that assumes many values. Examples, u, v, x, y, and z. So, ibig sabihin, halimbawa, ang value ng x ko is equivalent to 2. So, x is equivalent to 2. Number 3, a term. A term is an expression preceded by a plus or minus sign and involves two or more factors. May tinatawag kasi tayong one term, two terms, so on and so forth. Examples, 3u to the fourth power v, x over 9, 6, and y. Number 4, numerical coefficient. A numerical coefficient is the constant factor of the term. Example, and 3x to the 4th power y, ang 3 ang siyang tinatawag natin numerical coefficient. Number 5, literal coefficient. A literal coefficient is a factor representing a variable of a term. Example, and 3x to the 4th power y, x to the 4th power y is the literal coefficient. So, ibig sabihin, sinabi na ang variable of a term, variable ang literal coefficient. Number 6, monomial. A monomial is a term involving only the product of real number and variables with non-negative integral exponents. Example, 3u to the 4th power v, negative 6xy, and t. Kaya siya tinawag na monomial kasi only one term lang. Number 7, binomial. A binomial is a polynomial consisting of exactly two terms. Example, x plus 16. So, kaya siya tinawag na binomial kasi involving two terms, the x and 16. Number 8, trinomial. A trinomial is a polynomial consisting of exactly three terms. Example, p minus 3q plus 6. Kaya siya tinawag na trinomial kasi tatlong term ang involved. The P, negative 3Q, and positive 6. Number 9, polynomial. A polynomial is a sum of finite numbers of monomials. Example, M cubed plus 3M squared minus 2M minus 3. So, kaya siya tinawag na polynomial because apat na terms ang meron. So, M cubed, positive 3M squared, negative 2M, negative 3. Number 10, Two monomials or two terms that have the same literal coefficient ay tinatawag natin similar terms. Pag magkaiba ang literal coefficients nila, dissimilar. Examples, similar terms, 9uv and negative 12uv. Kung mapapansin nyo, pareho ang variable na meron sila. Dissimilar terms, 9u cubed, v squared, and u squared, v cubed. Kaya siya tinawag na dissimilar terms kasi magkaiba ang degree ng mga variable na meron sila. Number 11. The degree of the polynomial is the greatest exponent occurring in the variable. Example, in x cubed plus 3x squared minus 2x minus 3, the degree of the given polynomial is 3. Kaya 3, ang sinasabi dyan, kaya degree of the polynomial, yung pinakamataas ang value ng exponent. So, yun na lahat ang basic terms na kailangan nating maunawaan para tayo makapag-proceed sa operations on algebraic expressions. Addition of algebraic expressions. To add two or more algebraic expressions with the same literal coefficient, add only their numerical coefficient and affects the literal coefficients. 
Examples, 2m plus 7m is equivalent to, magsamahin mo muna yung dalawang number, so 2 plus 7, then copy the variable m is equivalent to 9m. Another example, negative u squared v plus 4u squared v is equivalent to, pagsamahin muli natin ang mga number, so open and close parenthesis, negative 1 plus 4, then copy the variable u squared v is equivalent to 3u squared v. Bakit naging 3? Kung mapapansin natin, unlike sign ang negative 1 plus 4, ang isa ay negative, ang isa ay positive, automatically, siya ay magma-minus and copy the sign of a bigger number. So, ang sagot dito ay 3u squared v. Next, subtractions of algebraic expressions. To subtract algebraic expressions, change the sign of the subtrahend and proceed in addition following the rules in addition of signed numbers. Example, 2a plus 7b minus c subtracted by a minus 5b plus 5c. So next, copy the minuend 2a plus 7b minus c. Then susundin natin yung rules ng subtraction of algebraic expressions na change the sign of the subtrahend. So negative times positive a ay magiging negative a. Negative times negative 5b ay magiging positive 5b. Negative times positive 5c ay magiging negative 5c. Then after that, pwede na nating i-add. So, magsisimula tayo sa kanan. Negative c plus negative 5c ay magiging negative 6c. So, bakit siya naging negative 6c? Kasi negative 1 plus negative 5 equals negative 6 and copy the variable c. Then next, positive 7b plus positive 5b is equivalent to 12b. Then next, 2a plus negative a is equivalent to positive a. Bakit naging positive a? Kasi kung papansinin natin, unlike sign siya, so automatic magma-minus and copy the sign of a bigger number. So 2 minus 1 is 1, then copy the variable a. Aalisin talaga natin yung 1 sa katabi ng a kasi yun ang sinusunod natin sa rules ng math. So, the answer is A plus 12B minus 6C. So, guys, sana may natutunan ulit kayo. Thank you for watching and listening. Sa susunod ulit.